Sorry, I'm on a Sunday, and uh, I checked my, uh, well, Sunday, December 18th to be exact, uh, in South Africa, and I checked my, I opened my phone, and look what they said. They had Google, usually Google does a few things like G-O, and then oh, the other O would have something in it, or the G has something in it, but now they have just G-O-O, -O, and then a picture of a black guy, and then GLE. I said, oh, what's that? I said, I know, it looks like somebody I know. So I hit that icon, you know, the, the, the Google icon. And um, I hit the Google icon. <laughs> and I go, oh, it's Steve Biko. The rendering is not really, it doesn't look like Steve Biko. Anyway, so I looked there and said, oh, they did a thing on Steve Biko. That's good. So now if you, if you hit this, Steve Biko quotes an overview like that. I don't, don't you know this thing? It has some stuff about Steve Biko. But then I also, um, uh, people also search for, under Steve Biko, they search for, then they have uh, Donald Woods. So I know Donald Woods. That's the guy, that's, that was a reporter that, um, that you know, wrote about Biko and, and well, knew him and befriended him and, and, and wrote, all, uh, wrote several articles in the UK about him. Uh, then you have uh, 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 Mabella Ram, Rampele, and she's a, uh, well, we don't know that she's uh, Steve Biko's, was Steve Biko's mistress. And then uh, you have the, oh, you should say something about mistress. Let me, let me say this, because people get all, all combobulated, especially if you're in a, some sort of these Christian notions. Now, in the, in the times, it just happened, especially in the civil rights movement, especially had the thing with Martin, Martin Luther King was, was you know, uh, was, had affairs with women, and everybody but Malcolm X, actually. <laughs> Um, because it, 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 it's, it's Jesse Jackson, all these people. But the thing is, if you knew for certain that you might die at any point, all kinds of things happen, you know. So I think I'm not forgiving. Well, I am. I'm forgiving people. That's what happens. So anyway, she's known for that, uh, and uh, she's a politician here in South Africa. She sort of messed up last year because she, she was head of. I think she was head of COPE, and then she. Played kissy kissy with uh, with the DA and I anyway, I don't know what's going to happen. Her. Nelson Mandela, I said, you know who Nelson Mandela is. Robert Mangles or Robert Sabukwe, you have him look him up. One of my heroes. He went here to the University of Fort Hare. Rob, um, Robert Sabukwe is amazing. If you if you get any kind of writings or whatever you have, you should check him out. But him, he's, he's like a. They were so afraid of him that when he went to Robin Island, they, they put him in solitary confinement for real. He couldn't even talk to his guard. Nelson Mandela had it a lot easier. Uh, Chris Honey, uh, Chris Honey, one of the real heroes. Uh, that cat, you know, he was like he did it all. He was a soldier. He was a politician. He was a he related with everybody. You know, Chris Honey, and you know, he got killed. Otherwise, he probably would have been the first president. Uh, you know, Democratic elected president of South Africa. You have uh, uh, Lamelo uh, Pico, I guess. It's Steve Pico's son, Denzel, Denzel, oh, Denzel Washington, of course, because he played Steve Pico in, that, in the movie that based on Donald Woods' you know, things. In fact, it's interesting because, um, well, let's, let's leave it on. Uh, Franz Fanon, my man, woo, Franz Fanon, view all. Franz Fanon, that's, that's really, really, hey, it's good you have Franz, Franz Fanon. I mean, a psycholo psychologist, he really defined you know, what, what, what was happening between colonialism and, 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 the, and the, colon the colonized and the colonizers. Desmond Tutu, uh, okay, I'm there. Uh, Richard Attenborough, well, oh, Richard Attenborough, he did the film that uh, Denzel Washington and Kevin Klein was in. In fact, if we, we're here in, in, in Alice, but right down in um, uh, about an hour and a half from here, uh, in East London, there's a statue in front of uh, City Hall of Steve Biko, and it was sponsored by, you see all the names on it, Denzel's name is there, Richard, uh, Sir Richard Attenborough's name is there, Kevin Klein's, all the people that did it. So I, got, I guess somehow they must have, uh, you know, put some money into the building, to making this, this uh, statue, this bust of uh, Steve Biko down in East London. So you're in East London, you can go visit that. Uh, Jimmy Kruger, who's, oh, Jimmy Kruger, oh, that was, the, that was the guy who was in charge of the police force while he was, well, my uh, Steve Beagle got, got uh, killed. I like, think they, they, they left him like eight days, beating him up for eight days. Talk about torture. You know what I mean? And then finally they killed him. You know, that's where it was. Alo Tambo? Oh, Alo Tambo. Uh, head of the ANC. Then Patrice Lumumba, they have him there. That's interesting. Helen Sussman. Oh, Helen Sussman. In this case, she's, she's, uh, she's uh, you know, the, the white lady, the white lady, Jewish, whatever. She, um, 
she now talk about courage. She had a degree in uh, I think economics or something like that. Anyway, she became a politician, but she had, she was in charge of like some sort of progressive party. She was like the only one, the only white person in sitting in parliament at that time. You know, this racist Boer parliament uh, um, that 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 was that was basically speaking for you know the downtrodden. To, to all sets of this Helen Sussman, uh, uh, Tom and Becky, they got him there. Uh, uh, Walter Susubo, yeah, William Mandela, F.W. De Klerk, Thomas Sankara, whoa, that's interesting. They have Thomas Sankara, you know, the head of Burkina Faso, you know, he got assassinated too, of course, but I'm going to get into all that. And Malcolm X here, uh, Hector Peterson, I don't know who that is, Peter Gabe, I don't know who that is, Marcus Garvey. So these are all people that, you know, if you, you search for this, if you go to that. So, so this is uh, Steve Beagle's birthday, his life day. And uh, so just Steve Beagle, black consciousness. You know, he said, what's his most, one of his most famous sayings was something like, um, uh, the, the, the biggest weapon or the weapon in the hands of the oppressor is the mind of the oppressed. Something like that. So, so I'm, I'm paraphrasing it wrong, I'm sure. But basically, you know, the reason why the oppressor can continue to oppress the downtrodden is because the downtrodden gave up their minds. You know, and uh, it, it's a terrible thing. It's, it's, uh, let me take, go off just a little bit. Uh, yesterday, I had this uh, this tiff, whatever it is, with this uh, two professors from um, one from Nigeria, I don't know where he's from. And you know, they was going to this thing about, and I was going like, this Christianity, I'm, I'm through with this, you know. And they go, oh no, Jesus is the way, and 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 uh, and, uh, you know, and what are you gonna do? Go go to go. You know, don't you want to go to heaven and all this stuff? And I'm looking at these people like they done lost their mind. They would rather hang out with you know with, with the lineage of Jesus. You know they they they, they still talk about Jesus than Steve Biko. Well, maybe it's Biko coming me now. But they talk about sooner talk about uh, Jesus than Marcus Garvey. Their 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 minds are so you know it's it's amazing to me. It's just amazing to me. The African mind is so colonialized. The fact that the black American mind is so colonialized that they, the colonization is a colonization of the mind. And I just wish people would just, if anything, listen to Steve Biko. Free your mind and your liberation will follow. That's a, what he would say, I suppose. Well, that's just a, that's just a thing between George Clinton and Steve Biko. I've put them both together there like that. Me being T from the past and second to transit to bed, letting you know what I only suspect. <laughs>